Hello, YouTube. I'm Jake from Peyton B and their friend. And today we have a, I think, $40 flea market haul. Oh boy. Let's get this very heavy bag here out of the unboxing basket. And, um, all right, we got CDs, CDs, uh, stuff, <laughs> um, well, some more stuff, um, now let's dollars um let's see stuff stuff uh, more stuff is that everything uh yeah it seems so, all right, so now let's take a look and see what we have here. All right, so off, they have these three buttons, they were like a um, dollar each, and um. Yeah, I just think they're cool. Uh, yeah, and also very old. That too. Um, oh yeah, and this button here is square, which I think it's cool too. Um, yes, because as you guys know, I I love buttons, and I especially love big buttons. And that I cannot lie about. <laughs> All right, so. Next here, <laughs> we have a rosary. You guys might be asking, Jake, why in your right mind would you buy a rosary? But you see, it was for my great mission to um not let anyone else have it. Okay? I know, guys, very noble. Um, and you see, now that I have prevented any poor soul from having this rosary, now I, um, well, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. <laughs> um, yeah. All right, so next... Up, since in my last video I had two rings, or well, my last um, flea market haul video, at least. Um, yes, I had two rings, which is indeed not enough for me and Pay and B and Ray. So instead. Now I have gotten us some rings, which, I mean, they don't match, but these were also like a dollar each, but I think they're very cool. So this one's going to be for me, and it has bones, because um, I like bones. My favorite kind of bones are... um chicken bones because uh, I like to chew on them. Alright, next 
we have a ring for pay and B. Um, it. Um, I don't know what's up with this pattern here that it has, but it's got a little blue shine to it, which I think is cool. All right, and then next, this rings for Ray, and um, it's also cool. Got two theater masks here, and um, the one on the left here is the happy one, and on the right is the sad one. But if you switched them around, then it would look like the album cover for Theater of Pain by Motley Crue, which I think is cool. So, um, yeah, rings. And again, also this rosary here, this was like 50 cents, I think. They cut me a deal, because originally it was a dollar. They was like, oh, you can have it for 50 cents. So either they was having a hard time getting rid of this, or they must have thought that I was in dire need of salvation. Even though that is not my intention with this. Alright, next. Um, speaking about those in salvation... In need of salvation, in fact, not receiving any. We have not only DVD movies, we got VHS movies. Now, I don't want to be rude, but the guy who was selling these was uh, rude as shit. I'm going to be for real, okay? Because he was like, okay, he was yelling like, Ma'am! 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 And, you know, obviously, I'm not no ma'am, okay? And, you know, this woman, like, right beside me goes, like, Um, I think that sir there is addressing you. And, you know, so I walk over to this guy, but I, I just made sure to, um, look, to clearly look like I did not give a shit about whatever he was saying, He's like, oh, the movies are the dollar and the, the VHS, I don't know, like, I think it's 25 cents, which is why I got four, because I didn't want to give this guy any change, but, um, yeah, so, that was, in fact, rude, not only yelling ma'am at someone who's halfway across the place, but also yelling ma'am at someone who is, in fact, not even a ma'am. That's, at that point, that's just a bit stupid. Alright, so enough of that. First off here, we got the movie Rango. Because, um, yeah, recently I figured out that apparently I did not have this. Which I'm very baffled by. But now I do have it. Rango Tango Sweepstakes. Enter for a chance to win a 2011 Ford Escape Hybrid. Or one of 50 new Wii bundles with Mario Kart Wii. Or one of 10 $100 gift certificates from Snapfish. What? Um, thanks for buying. Well, who wants this code? Um, <laughs> um, okay, then <laughs> that's very interesting. All right, so here we got the disc itself. Um, boring design, but to sleek. Also, I like the fact that the case here is yellow, though, since it's a Nickelodeon movie. Which is very nice. Which, I mean, the first time I seen this movie, it was on Nickelodeon, so... Because I used to watch that a lot whenever I was uh, once a child. Alright, and then here we have Ghost Rider, because... 
I'm pretty sure we don't have this film. And if we do, then now we have it twice. Should have checked, but then again, I'm pretty sure we don't. Alright, so here's the disc itself. Much, much more decorative, if I do say so myself. So it says right here, big text out, widescreen. Um, okay. Oh, I mean, it says right here, widescreen edition. I guess this was back in a time whenever widescreen was not as common. Yeah, it says right there. And enamor perfect widescreen. Oh, and it's in color. I wouldn't have known. Alright, next. We got VHSs, which um I can't test these because I don't have a VCR. And admittedly, three of these I just bought so that again no one can have them. Um because yeah, so I would not want to test these. I mean, then again, bro, like, <laughs> you know, if I do test them, and then, like, um, then, like, a freaking alternate pops out of the screen. That'd be crazy. Like, man. Alright, so, I mean, we got Veggie Tales here, which, you know, I mean, Veggie Tales, it's, it's okay, um, I don't know, I was, yeah, we had to watch this in church quite a bit, and I'd say that was probably the only entertaining thing that we did. Alright, then we got... Animated stories from the New Testament. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, I don't know. Then again, is this? Would you consider any of this factual or fictional? Because I don't know, guys. If you heard my opinion, you probably wouldn't be too surprised. But I'm sure there would be at least someone here who would disapprove of it. Alright, and then next we got Dead Poets Society. Which, um... I know, guys, probably a bit of a random pick, but, um... You see, in my advanced reading class that I had in ninth grade, I remember we had to watch this. I mean, bro, it was like... Not gonna lie, it was actually a good movie, yeah. And also, a bit fruity, if I do say so myself. I guess I haven't pulled out any of the tapes here. Let's see what we got. Yeah, there it is. Man, whoever watched this, you know, they did not take that advice of be kind. Please rewind. How rude. I don't know, did any of this people rewind? I mean, I, actually, I can't tell. I think they did. Um, okay, good. Good, you better rewind. And again, this dude also had a lot of other of these Christian VHSs, but I only got these ones. There was some of these that was like Old Testament, but I think the Old Testament is kind of more based than the New Testament, because I don't know, man, Jesus is kind of mid- Dude, I can't get this out, like, oh, oh, right, when I said that, um, the hair in my mouth, okay, yeah, so at least this person, rewind, um, very, very good, uh, 
Um, don't try that at home. Please, for love of goodness, don't. I've got veggie tails. Okay. Uh, where's God when I'm scared? You know what? Where was God whenever I was in church being touched? Hmm? Would anyone like to answer that? <laughs> you know, God, is this what you let happen in your holy house? You let children be touched? What's wrong with you? Um, alright, next. <laughs> We got what is in this bag? Oh, yeah, some old man, another a, a different old man, um, gave this to me and for free, w without asking if I wanted it. Um, yeah, I think he was seriously trying to flirt with me. Um. I'm just going to set this to the side because I actually don't know if I should eat it or not. Um, oh yeah, while we're still complaining about Christians though. um, Okay, there was this guy doing, um, I'm going to be honest, like unsoliciting, unsolicitedly handing these out. <laughs> and, um... Yeah, so anyway, the, while I was sitting down, this guy, who I want to mention, too, was wearing, like, a, a, a fake leather jacket with spikes on it. Okay. So, um, first off, you know, um, I don't know why he'd be dressed like that, trying to spread the word of, um, Jesus. Because, um, I don't know, the way that uh, the Americans make Jesus sound, he would does not probably approve of dressing in such a manner. But, yeah, handed me this card here. Um, yes. You know what? I mean, I don't know who these people are, but whoever you are, you know, um... This this is personally my gesture towards you. Um yes, anyway, this guy guy was, you know, like I don't remember like, you know, do you believe and I just, you know, I don't answer cuz I did not want to engage. But then, you know, he was like, you know, um where would you rather go? Heaven or hell? And you know what my reply was? I know where I'm going. Now, before I could finish my sentence, he, um, he slipped this card beside me and then walked off. And obviously, after he walked off, I ripped it in half, as one does. You know, um, he didn't let me finish my sentence. But as you guys can guess, if I would have finished my sentence, then the answer to where I'm going is hell. To which I don't really mind, because, um, Satan loves me, and, um, Satan thinks that I'm hot, and I think that he's hot, <laughs> So, our feelings towards each other are mutual, so it's okay. Alright, so next, up here. You know, I mean, honestly, some people are just different. Some people are just different in very different ways. Alright, Alright. So... Thank goodness that that guy was back who sells all the music CDs. 
Because guess what I got? Music CDs. I actually went over to him once. Alright, uh, and then I had to go over to him again because um, I, I really wanted... Um, let's see here. What did I really, really want? Oh yeah, it was incest aside by Nirvana. But, yeah, we have here, this is two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six, this is seven music CDs. Um, let's take a look here at what we have. First, here, up here, um gonna be honest don't remember the name of this compilation album but I do know first off this is the version where it does have shot in the dark on it for track number nine which is good and um oh yeah this is uh the Osman cometh <laughs> So, also, I think this is the first time I've gotten a, um, Zix CD where there is two discs. So, anyway, let's see in here what our booklet has to say. Alright, this is another one where it folds out. Okay, then, um... Oh, wait, does it... I, I guess it starts here. Okay. Well, alright. Yeah, here we have information and pictures about all our tracks here. And then have... I mean, honestly, though, I admit, there's a lot of good songs on here. And, of course, we have all our credits to Aludra. Alright. Let's put that back. And then... We'll uh, get both of the discs out. Um, also, I gotta say though, the disc designs here. Um, oh, it seems like this person had the discs mixed up. Um, but. Yeah, these here, I gotta say, um, other than the dark side of the moon disc, these are probably the coolest ones that I've seen, at least so far. Alright. I like this here too. Upside down cross. Hell yeah. Alright, next, we got Eliminator by ZZ Top. Yes, the case here, it's very cracked. Um, there was another one there, which was it did not cracked, but um, I'm not picky with the cases. So, it's okay that it's cracked. I mean, it's still, um, functional. Alright, let's try to get this out of here. Um, Alright, there we go. Yeah, so...
here. Uh, now we got ZZ Top International Fan Club P.O. Box. Uh, okay. Oh, and we got the copy pasta here, too. The compact... Disc digital audio system offers the best possible sound reproduction on a small convenient disc. Yes, yes. Okay, this Yeah, this doesn't give me no information. Come on. Um Oh well. Sad I kinda don't have any pictures of the band members though, cause if you guys haven't, like, seen any, like, ZZ Top music videos or anything, like, damn, they're an interesting bunch, that's for sure. Alright, so, here we have Big Ones by Aerosmith. If I can get this booklet out. Alright, there we go. Um, oh boy, hopefully we have some color in here. Uh, oh, what? Wait, what's going on? Um, huh? Oh, well. Um, here's all our lyrics. Okay, now this here, though, I gotta admit, this is cool. Alright, so, here we go. Dang. Alright. That is definitely one cool... Can't say booklet, um... A thing that folds out. Yes. Also, this disc here is cool. Okay. Um. All right. Next up, we got. Look what the cat dragged in. By poison. As you guys probably know if you've seen, not sure which unboxing video it was where I did actually show off my case with all my CDs, um, but you guys know I do already have uh, this uh, which, um, I, I burnt it myself. Okay, I will admit. So what's up with this U that someone wrote on here? What the heck? Um, I'm just gonna ignore that. Um, alright. But, this is, of course, my favorite Poison album. So, there we go. I wanted to get it on its own CD. <laughs> uh, we pledge allegiance to our fans for which this band will always stand. <laughs> um... Yes, here on the inside we have all the lyrics. Oh, and then we have this, uh, the compact disc digital audio system offers a small convenience, small sound carrier, state-of-the-art sound reproduction. What? Okay. Um. Hey, it does say on here that this is AAD, 
which if you guys read it in here, is um, basically the best you can get. <laughs> so, yeah, now we have it in this form. Wish they did have some more information in the booklet, though. I think the Flesh and Blood booklet was way better, honestly. Alright, next we got Diver Down by Van Halen. Disc out of there. Not even anything interesting on that disc. Alright. Now let's see what we got here. Now oh, this is kind of cool. Should I mail one of these P.O. boxes something someday? Like, I don't know. Do any of these P.O. boxes even exist still? Um, not sure. Oh, there's a picture of the whole band here. See, now this is... This here is Van Halen. Okay? We got Michael Anthony. We got Alex Van Halen. We have David Lee Roth. And we have Eddie Van Halen. Okay? This is Van Halen. Regardless of what the 5150 booklet will try to tell you. Okay. Um, if I can get this in here. Um, alright, there we There we go. Okay. Alright, next. Whoops. Um. <laughs> okay, next. We have Incesticide by Nirvana. Also, I just gotta say, the side here, this is probably, like, the coolest side that I've seen here. Oh, we got Ducky. Uh, Quack. Please tell me the disc is cool, please. Oh, yes! Why is there a little piece of bubble wrap? Um, heck. Um, okay then. Alright. Very cool disc. So pretty much, um, now I have almost all of the Nirvana albums. Because I burnt Bleach myself. Because that's my favorite album. And then now I have this. Um... I bought Nevermind a while ago, which I can link in the description if you all would be so pleased. Oh, what's this? Um, yeah, and then in utero, I, well, I don't have... A, um, I'm hoping I can just find it somewhere, cause, uh, admittedly, um, you know, I don't want to, like, burn that, too. I just burn discs whenever I can't find the album anywhere, like, without having to go on the internet, cause, you know, I don't want to have to be buying music. Over the uh, internet, because um, I don't want to. Yeah. 
Yeah, and then last but not least, um, we have Sammy Hagar unboxed. Um, I'm gonna be honest, the only song that I know of Sammy Hagar's solo career is, um, I Can't Drive 55. If you haven't seen that music video though, you should go watch it because um it's cool. Also, who is Cheap Thrills Bargain Used CDs? Date 050505. What? Price is six dollars. Well, I paid four for this, so I kinda like this disc. It's a a black box in the middle. Um, oops. Uh, <laughs> all right. Let's see our booklet here. And these booklets are also in like kind of poor condition, which is make. Making me admittedly question some things like, um, I'm probably a, what the heck? Um, let's try to get this pulled apart here. Um, Oops. Uh, <laughs> um. Okay, well, um, here's what we do have of the booklet. Um, what the heck happened to this? What? I mean, other than me, like, what happened before me? What? Um,. Uh, well, um, that, I went up and put it back in there, um, yeah, uh, whoopsie daisies, <laughs> um, oh my, um, since there's so many, discs though um i'm gonna test them out in the next video which will be linked down below um because we have literally like one two three four five six seven eight and there's like eight discs here to test and um i don't want to make this video too long for you guys so um yeah, if you like this video, give us a like, give us a subscriber, and comment down below where you're going. I know where I'm going. And, um, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.